Soundside.js is another library that NightLab puts on your hands as an auditory storytelling tool. Having said that, this library makes it easy to add life to cold rigid text using audio which leads to a better experience for readers. To create such element, just go to the authoring tool on the NightLab website and hit the make a clip button. Then grab a link of an audio sample from SoundCloud and hit load. The next step we need to do is to choose the limits of the clip we want to use and make sure it's not so long that it could be boring for users. We can set the number of repetitions after the first play and then we need to set the text which will contain the player. Now to embed this clip we need to copy and paste the generated code in ours or you can install and use the plugin they provide if you want to add it to a blog post. And the last step we need to do is to copy and paste the links to the CSS and the GS scripts in the head tag of our code. Finally, we have the ability to change the style of the element as we want, so we can change the font size for example, by setting the style attribute to the span or the p tag that contains it. Soundside.js actually uses an API key generated by the creators of the library. That key though has a limit set to 15,000 calls per 24 hours. That being said, that key can be used by people all around the world at the same day so, if the limit is reached, I mean the 15,000 calls within 24 hours, your app users or blog post readers won't be able to play the embedded clip. So, to overcome that problem, you'd want to create your own API key, which is free. However, API keys requests are stopped for now, unfortunately, so you'd have to use the NightLabs key until SoundCloud opens the application requests again. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.